Hey, this is Dr. Bo Schilling, he's my preceptor, and we are discussing a pre-anesthetic and peri-anesthetic protocol for a patient writer. He is here for a neuter today. So Dr. Bo Schilling, um, what, uh, based on what we discussed, um, what did you choose for our analgesia for our patient today? So we have our anesthetic protocol will involve giving him meds ahead of time. So we're going to give him an NSAID called meloxicam that will provide, uh, it's the only anti-inflammatory pain medication we have. And that will last for about 24 hours and we'll send him home with doses as well to give after surgery. Um, for his pre-medicants, uh, pre we're going to use a sedative called Dextomator. Um, that's a more potent sedative because he's a pretty wiggly patient and without that we may have a challenge getting his IV catheter placed. We're going to use buprenorphine, which is an opioid, which just provides pain relief. And then we'll use a non-pain med called glycopyrrolate to help him maintain his heart rate and decrease salivation during the procedure. Okay, you've also chosen us to give um, Combipin, um, and that's for pre-medication for antibiotics. Right, and so it's debatable to use perioperative antibiotics, but we just want to minimize the risk of skin infections from surgery especially in the first 24 hours, so that's what we use penicillin. Great, and then also we're going to induce anesthesia with propofol uh, for this patient. That's right, so uh, in order to get him intubated and get him on isofluorine gas, uh, which is his main anesthetic, we'll use propofol to induce anesthesia. Okay, sounds good. Sounds good. Hey, thanks.